The best part of waking up. He snuggles with your pup. I can tell you what Christmas is all about. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 6, I think. Again, don't quote me on that because I've got no clue what day it is. <laughs> so the kids are dropped off at school. It's now almost 10 o'clock and they've been at school for like over an hour now. I am heading into the office today even though technically I'm supposed to be off today but I've got some work that I need to get done that's time sensitive so I'm going in. Um, why do I feel like there is a smudge? Maybe it's just on my screen. I don't know. It's kind of cloudy and gloomy out today. It's supposed to get up to a high of like 81 in Orlando. So, let's do it that. Sorry. It's supposed to get up to like a high of 81 or so in Orlando. Shoot, I forgot my breakfast. Guess we're drinking coffee for breakfast. Looks like it wants to rain today. Who knows? Come on, bro. Oops. So, yeah. I'm going to take care of that stuff in the office. Then I need to pop into the five below on the way home. Try and find Lila, that neck pillow, for our trip. stocking stuffers are good to go. We don't need to stuff anymore into those. What else did I need to do today? I've got the presents wrapped. Ooh, ooh, yay for me. Oh, I need to go to Dollar Tree and get three medium-sized bags to stuff the neck pillows in. Oh, okay. So, I need to get three of those. finish that up. These glasses are super dirty. <laughs> um, what else? I need to go to Dollar Tree to get those bags, like I said. I kind of want to bake cookies today, but I feel like I've got other things that I need to do first. Um, 
we definitely need to, oh, the COVID car is gone. There's like a COVID van that usually sits out here and does like COVID testing, but it's not there anymore. Hmm. Um, sorry, squirrel. I probably should start packing, but I don't know if I want to wait until Josh gets the bins that we're going to be traveling with. So instead of using suitcases, we're going to be using like Tupperware bins since we're driving in a truck and everything's going to be in the bed. Even though the bed has a tonneau cover, like a hard tonneau cover. So uh, whatever, he wants to do it. I will get my grocery list and all of that put together. That's what I'll do. I will go home and get that done. I can do that. I should start folding our clothes today. I got all the kids stuff folded and it's in their bedrooms for them to put away. That's been the case for a couple of days now. You know what? You guys are probably sick of me talking about laundry, so I'll probably still mention it just because it's on my brain and this kind of works for me because it's like a verbal list in my head. So yeah, I'm gonna go to the store, head home, finish working. Bumpy road. Hopefully this person emails me back so I can finish working when I get home. Um, I do have to pick the kids up at 1.30, 2 o'clock. It's 12.30. I need to finish editing Vlogmas from yesterday, so I'll do that in the car line and have that ready. And then, yeah. Bliss for Tennessee and clothes. Those are on the list of things to do today. And if I have time, oops, you guys fell. If I have time, I will do cookies tonight. If I don't have time, we will do cookies tomorrow because tomorrow's Thursday and then the kids go to their other family's houses until we leave. So I have to do Christmas cookies tomorrow if the kids want to help. They don't usually want to help. I don't know what it is, but whatevs. So I'll probably just make Christmas cookies myself. Oh, I gotta look at that um, Rice Krispie Treats thing that I had gotten for them because I don't know more speed bumps. I don't know if I need to bring anything with me. Come on. Out in the middle of the road, lady. Use your noodle. Um, I don't know if I need to bring anything with me up to the cabin because if I don't then I'll just bring it with me but if I have to bring stuff at like ingredients then we'll do it at home but yeah we're just rambling at this point and I'm at five below so I will talk to y'all later <laughs>
my Domini and actually I'll share with you my Chipotle order because I know that like Starbucks orders and Chipotle orders are interesting to people. I know they're interesting to me because I'm nosy. This is my Chipotle order. I get a salad so that the lettuce is on the bottom. Uh, no vinaigrette. I'm not a fan of the vinaigrette. A little bit of white rice, a little bit of black beans, the um, fajita vegetables, no protein, like no meat or anything like that. I'm not a vegetarian. I just don't enjoy it on the bowls. Then I get the mild picante, not picante, um, pico. So like just the tomatoes, the corn salsa, cheese, and guacamole. And look how colorful and pretty this is. Like, delicious. I'm so excited for this. Oh my God, that was so... Ah, yummy, I almost fell over. <sighs> but I have to say, after eating Chipotle, jeans are not the move. Like, we can't be wearing jeans after Chipotle. So now we've got sweatpants on. So I have to go pick up the kids. So... Let's go do that real quick. Let me give you a Christmas a moment we'll fill with love and joy. Mm -mm, so beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you. I don't need any presents as long as I spend this day with you. Mm -mm, so beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you. Making plans, what we're gonna do? I feel so blessed that I can be with you. Cause God knows that I've been longing for you. Yeah, I just wanna hold you close. You know the stars are shining just for you. Let's take a walk and we can follow the moon. Let's till we reach a place we can stay. Maybe kiss a bit and dream away. And in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire. Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy There's just something about an unmixed iced coffee that looks so cool. You know what I mean? Don't mind Amazon behind me. Like, <laughs> it's real, you know? Definitely the holidays. But look how cool that looks. I wish it could stay like that. It looks almost like a cold brew. about 5 45 we're gonna get started on some dinner we are making beef stroganoff for dinner tonight which is a family recipe of ours so i'm gonna show you how we make it Santa's busy saying ho, ho, ho. We're feeling jolly eating Christmas cake. And then we go skating on the frozen lake. Saying hi to every friendly face. And later we warm up by the fire.
So I did not get to film all of that because I got a call from my mom. So I talked to her for a while, but this is what it looks like. So after you brown the meat, um, you put the onions and the mushrooms in there. You put the lid on with a little bit of milk and I put in one bouillon cube, a little shake of, what is it? Soy sauce for like the salty flavor. And then I let that sit for a few minutes. Sorry about that. Um, what else did I put in there? Oh, and then I put the lid on it and I let that cook down until the mushrooms are soft and the onions are nearly soft. So they're like a little al dente. I do not like crunchy onions, but I don't like completely soft, mushy onion. So after the mushrooms, I forget where I left off. Dealing with kids, you know, the usual. So after the mushrooms and the onions get soft, I put two cans of cream of mushroom soup in there along with like a squeeze of the sour cream that we have. We use the squeezy sour cream, but it's probably like, I don't know, two tablespoons or so. And then I use a half of an ounce of cream cheese that I just kind of pick apart and put in there too until it melts down. And salt and pepper to taste. I usually use garlic salt here. I usually use garlic salt to add the salt content because the garlic kind of gives it an extra flavor and we love garlic. So that is beef stroganoff. And then this is just a pound and a quarter of ground beef. And this feeds all six of us. And the kids typically have seconds too. So um, the noodles, we just serve it over egg noodles. So I'm cooking those now, and once that's done, we're probably gonna have a salad on the side. And this is our final product. We'll get us a nice little salad, some beef stroganoff. Yummy, can't wait to eat it. Alrighty y'all, so it is seven o'clock. I am going to hop in the shower and get comfy because I want to blow dry my hair tonight, redo my nails, and yeah, relax. So I'm going to, end the vlog here early tonight because that's about all I'm going to be doing. Not very exciting. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. I hope you are subscribed. And if you're not, hit the notification bell and the subscribe button so you can be notified whenever I post a new vlogmas. We've got six more days to go because we're halfway through. So I hope to see you guys here tomorrow and hope you have a good night and I'll see you then. Bye y'all.